So do you have any knowledge of a, a ministerial ban on any unnecessary travel? Um, again, I don't know that there is any ban. What I do know is that the Prime Minister, everybody, whenever we travel, we have to apply for duty leave. You have to justify the travel. Um, and I think the Prime Minister has said, listen, there has been so many conferences, so many meetings. Um, he's now going to take a closer look at approving you know, whether or not you travel, but there is no ban. So is it that he's saying the ministers, you know what, kind of hold it down when you're traveling? Well, a, a, lot, a lot of the meetings um, are preparatory meetings. A lot of the meetings are meetings that no deliberative decision is going to be taken. Um, we firmly believe in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, and I think this informs a lot of ministers that if you're not around the table every step of the way or you know at the beginning and you try to come in at the end you get left out and it's a problem so we have been trying to scale up our representation and attendance at international meetings i think what the prime minister is simply saying is listen i will take a second look at every application for duty leave and determine whether it is absolutely necessary for example speaking to uh, the minister of agriculture today um, he was telling me that he was invited and expected to go to cairo um, to a meeting. He has asked his CEO and another officer to attend. I was supposed to go to Argentina today. In fact, all our foreign ministers of CARICOM were WhatsApping and saying, Eamon, where are you? I said, in discussion with Prime Minister, I'm not going to go to Argentina. I will stay and get this done and all the business that we have done during the course of this week. Um, so all of us are looking. We are being represented by CEO Mai and someone else. So we are looking at places where if you're not absolutely required, or if there's not something that your, your presence is necessary, then we should be represented by perhaps some official or a CEO.